Hello everyone, how are you guys tonight? You guys are live here on the Dixie Bell Paint Facebook and Instagram pages. My name is Brandy and I am the owner and artisan behind Brushed by Brandy. Um, I'm a Dixie Bell Paint brand ambassador and you can find me on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, YouTube. Um, and I paint here live with you guys every Thursday evening. So we are gonna do some painting tonight and we're gonna switch things up a little bit. So we're gonna try something we've never tried before. And I have a special guest host. So um, my husband, Sean, is always here behind the camera to help us answer questions. And he is here with us this week. And I am going to turn it over to our special guest host. Can, we just, can we just leave it that guy? I am taking the night off. Yeah, this, here's our special guest host. Welcome. He's going to do our painting for us tonight. Like one of those baby, one of those baby hands videos. Oh, I can do yeah, that. We'll do that. Here, here. Yeah. All right, you guys, here it is. Tonight. Oh, man. Hi, everyone. Oh. Hi, Sheila. Hi, Mary. So oh, man. Tonight, I am working behind the camera. <laughs> and in front of the camera, you guys get the voice, this the smart. mystery, the man. Sean, my husband, is going to pay for us tonight. I right? do all things painting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so go What's ahead. What's my background again? <laughs> Sean works at a bank. Not this. <laughs> yes, right. Marilyn, it is true. That is the one and only. So okay, go ahead. I'm you will not it over. see me. You will not see me down on the floor. Okay. So we have this beautiful piece here, and I've already cleaned it, scuff sanded it. Apparently, I uh, didn't clean the dust off. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't do that part. Appreciate you. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get that off. So I cleaned it with... What would you my, clean it with? My high school name. Oh. Lightning. <laughs> okay, you guys. So here's the test. I'm going to try to uh, restrict every bit of my OCD tendencies. This is going to be really hard for me. Um, and we're going to see if Sean has been paying attention from behind the camera for the last, I don't know, three years that you've been doing this All with me. All comments are welcome. Good, bad. <laughs> We're all I'll, friends here. I'll screen them. Yeah. <laughs> Laura says she loves this. Uh, oh, Sheila says, look at that hot stud. Bob yes, is he's Bob totally looks hot. good. He's yes. rocking that hair tonight. Wait, you got his good side. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> looking good, Bob. Hey. Looking good. All right. We need your masculine energy tonight. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So cleaned it with white lightning first, then came back and put some water on it. Kind of clean that up off, off just, of there. Just like a dip in the pool? Just like just, a dip in the pool. Just, just throw it right over my shoulder and threw it in the pool. Dumped a cup of water on it? Yes. Is he wearing shorty shorts? Who, Bob oh, or Bob or Sean? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> too much, too much. <laughs> too much leg. <laughs> I This body was not out running. Let's just Brit get that clear. Brittany says you missed a spot. Oh, I missed a lot of spots. <laughs> God did too. All right. So what I'm going to do is I've already scuff sanded this piece here. Brandy was nice enough to let me do the down low portion. I uh, I do not like to sit so low with the scooter, so that's why I've got it on the uh, table so I can raise it up. <laughs> this is my hydraulic table, you guys. So this is a lift table. It holds up to 500 pounds, okay, let's do this. and um, let's uh, just go to the it has turn. a it has a foot pump on the back. So this is I got this at Harbor Freight, and um, Sean doesn't do down low. Yeah, no. He doesn't get low. No, no. Brandy, you've changed. I grew a beard, Robin. Yeah, I almost did the intro, by the way. Yeah, that's Brandy, what, that's what that I look, look without Nair for a week. <laughs> All right. Stress makes you grow facial So there we go. We put, he's up on a lift table, you guys. So that's what the... So yes, what's Dan, get a hydraulic table. All right, what are you going to paint with tonight? Back. Oh, yeah, we have that's Instagram, back. too. Yeah. Hello. Expect shoddy camera work tonight, guys. More than usual. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> now it's story time. That's right. Oh man. <laughs> now I'm no, in, no, I'm in full control. I still control. have a short life even on this side of the camera. I'm gonna cut your head off like you always cut mine off. Oh, oh, yeah. Let me just like Revenge. get the halfway. Okay, uh, show us what you're gonna paint with tonight. Though. Okay, so I'm actually uh would you like to do an intro as far as the inspiration? Are you not supposed to be the one on camera tonight? What? I fully expect to do nothing. <laughs> <laughs> so I was tasked. Let's get, I'm going to walk over here. Um, okay, Claudia, you, uh, let's see, who said that? Yes, it, open your box. <laughs> oh, man. 
Okay, I'm trying to read the names as fast as I can. See, this, this is really bad <laughs> camera work. I don't appreciate this. Yeah, the hydraulic lift is amazing. I saw someone say that they thought, they said it wouldn't work for furniture. It does work. It works better for smaller pieces than large. What are you opening? I am opening a surprise to me inspiration box. Okay, so we pulled out the Dixieville inspiration boxes, the Brand Ambassador inspiration kits, and Sean is going to um, open one. He, we don't know which one it is. And he's going to paint from it. So. I don't know if Instagram can see me too. Oh, yeah, they can't. You're really, this, this really isn't working out. No, I, I, should, I think the talents are on the wrong side I of the should camera. Be paint, I should be painting. Let's see. Okay. Oh, I can tell whose it is. It's a good one, you guys. That's a good kit. Let's kick this out of the, out of the way. So do I open it nicely? Uh, Sherry, this is the 500 pound. They have a, a thousand pound one. I think it was in the $200 range. Oh, you know what? That kind of reminds me. I did hear that the camera adds 80 pounds, by the your, way. Your face isn't even on camera. No, That's cool. No one can even tell nobody, it's not Nobody me. cares what I yeah, say. Yeah, the body looks about the same. Uh, someone's guessing Tracy's box. It, it's pink like Tracy's Wait was. Wait for it. I'll grab the... Oh, it is Bianca's box. Bianca from Lotus Theory Designs. This is her inspiration box, which I love, by the way. It's a good kit. So Sean's going to open the kit. And then the theory behind the kits is you should be able to open them and, and just paint with the stuff from the box. So how did you prepare for Somebody this? knows me so well. How did you prepare for tonight? Now your face is on camera. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> for the people. Yeah, exactly. Okay, so I'm just going to run through... Can I just chop towels? Huh? That's my Costco load of shop towels in the background. Nice. All right, let's run through. Yes, Laura, it's the lace. Some. What color white is lightning, it? A white lightning. Way. Okay, we already cleaned it with white lightning, but there is white lightning in the kit. You always need that on your piece, no matter what your piece is. It always needs a cleaning with white lightning. All right. Next is burlap. Okay, that's a good color. A nice neutral. That's a burlap, it's kind of a neutral beige. Reminds me of Christmas. <laughs> but less, ex but all the things you didn't want. Stormy seas. It's like getting a sweater from your grandma. I gotta keep, I gotta repackage it so that I can return it to the store. It's one of those <laughs> yeah, kits. you cannot return your brand ambassador inspiration <laughs> kit. Amber, I'll put this on YouTube later. Actually, my virtual assistant uploads them for me. <gasps> Pine cone. I don't know where the camera is, by the way. So it's uh, here. That's really poor crap. Uh, Brandy here. loves your hat. My son ha you. has the same hat. They were twinning. We were twinning today. They were by twinning the way. today. I'm yes. like, you guys have the same shirt and hat on. That's not cool. Okay, let's set those aside. I want to keep going through the colors. What was the last color? Pine cone. Oh, oh, and stormy seas. Okay, stormy seas is like my favorite color in the line. Bianca did good on her box. Savannah mist. Ooh, that's There's way pretty. too much paint. Savannah Mist and Stormy Seas are a really good color combo. They're both those blue grays. One's a darker shade, one's a lighter. And you've got some beiges. This is just satin clear. Okay, we need satin clear coat. This Sorry, all comes in the kit, you guys. It all comes in the kit. And then it comes with... It comes with the card from Bianca. And on the back, it's got her inspiration piece with a QR code to a tutorial for this. So did you watch said tutorial? I did. I did. I have prepped as well as I can for this overall, but I did not watch. I've watched all of them. So next is sawmill gravy. Okay. That's pretty. That's a uh, sawmill gravy. is like a creamy white color. It's literally the color of gravy. Biscuits and gravy. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. What's gravy. that? Best thing brush. It is the best dang brush. Chip brush. Oh, that's a good idea. My cooking spatula. Um, I'm just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> I know, at least I'll have the best dang brush, Jackie, because that fixes we'll about everything, that, right? That I, everything I fully expect to have to go back and fix this piece. Yeah. And silver gilding wax. Oh, okay. That's going to be really pretty. Okay, so it's a very blue and beige combo with the silver. Thank you for that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm being like, I, I'm copying like ESPN. Everything I see from them is what I'm doing right oh, now. That's good. You just yeah. repeat what everyone good says. Good job there, Johnny Pinch. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the lace transfer. That's probably one of my favorite transfers in the line. The lace transfer, it's very elegant, very classy. 
Um, Beyond, Brittany has little faith in you. She watches you every week. She knows you too well. I have little faith in you. <laughs> let's just call it what it okay, is. Okay, so let's get started, you guys. Let's, let's go forward. ahead and put some of our, uh, some of our, a lot of browns and blues, very pretty look to go with the lace transfer. All right, Instagram, let's see where you guys are. Well, they're really up, up close and personal. There we go. Yeah. Okay, so I think, just going to wing it. Kidding. Um, we'll start with, oh, I need some water. Oh, wait, <laughs> I, I can make you go get stuff no, now. I'm on no, this side. Here, I have water. Oh. The straw is only slightly used. How much are the kits? Jennifer, they vary in price. Um, you can go onto the Dixie Bell site. Uh, I put a link in the post over on Facebook. I'll make it a link directly to the kits once I get off. Um, and they vary in price. It depends on what the contents of them are. Um, if you look under the paint section on the Dixieville website, you will find the Brandon Master Inspiration Kits. Did he fall down? I don't, did he fall down? Did I miss it? Dang it. Where do we buy the Brandon Master websites? Uh, Katarina, um, on the website, you can look under paint. They're under the paint tab. I will put a link directly in the post. I didn't have time to make one before we got on, but when I get off, it will be a link directly to the boxes. All right, so I think what I'm going to do is at least start off with some Savannah Mist. Okay, solid choice. Oh, yeah, or Tara said search inspo. You can search inspo, I-N-S-P-O. What? She didn't send beer in the kit for you? <laughs> Bianca the would put beer. beer in her kit, too. <laughs> okay, so Elizabeth, you're asking about what prep we've done so far on this piece here. No, this is just a scuff sanding. It is solid wood. Um, it's not going to be a bleeder. It's a light color wood, a fairly modern piece. So we just cleaned it, scuff sanded, and it's getting painted. So this was not one that needed a primer. All right, Sean is giving his paint a good shaking. He's learning all about opening paint containers. You want me to open this? It's the least I can do. Should we juggle? Yeah, no, one, two. They're okay. I'm running out of hands. That's right. Oh, I got them. All right, sad and clear coat. I'm not going to open these. Good times, good times. We'll be lucky if we get through the paint part. Yeah, this is so true. <laughs> All, right. All right, shake your paint containers when you first get them. They need a mixing. They've settled a little bit in transport. Oh, Shauna, your 11 year old likes us. Well, he. Uh, oh, well, that's my group. That That's like my. That, that's, that's, yeah. That's, I'm in my zone. It's uh, yeah. Sean's um, mental yeah. capacity is about the same as your 11 year old. Actually, that she's much smarter than I. Roxanne, these uh, brand ambassador kits are available on the w Dixie Bell website and also through your local retailer. They vary in price depending on what the contents are. Some of the kits are a little bit larger than others depending on what the look is. What is what's that in the back? Oh, that's my piece we worked on last week, but you guys can't see is that. that yet. Eagle Eye. Yes, yes, Sean's demographic, <laughs> exactly, Susan. Oh man, I'm trying not to block the camera. Let's go this way. Ah. I don't know Sorry. what we're doing. I'm not comfy on camera so much. Yeah, this, I just... this I can tell. It is never comfortable being on, on camera. Yes, good tip. Uh, uh, Dampen the, the brush first. What's Helps that? a little bit. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's using a little bit of water. This color is Savannah Mist. All right, that looks nice and smooth. That's a smooth coat. Oh, my gosh. I'm pretty thrilled about that. Wow. That's... All right, I'm done. That's it. I'm <laughs> yeah. out. I'm out. Take your wins where you can. Just I go agree. with it. I'm just going to hit the perimeter. Um, did Sean use the special regs? No, he was wearing them at the time. <laughs> it's like paint by numbers. I don't like these numbers. You know, it's funny you mentioned the OCD part. You, I'm all about lines and all this stuff, and you, well, not so much. It's smooth, though, you guys. I will tell you, that is a smooth coat. Okay, so he's using the Dixie Bell Mini and a little bit of water. It's going on smooth. That just makes me happy because I know I can fix it easy without sanding. <laughs> smooth. Thank you so much. Smooth like his uh, high school nickname. Oh, where is it? <laughs> White lightning. 
This is Bianca's Lace Inspiration Box. All right, he's working in Savannah Mist. He just shoves the brush into the paint. What? <laughs> yeah. Uh, reckless abandon. Uh, I know. So, Tara, that's what I was thinking is like, okay, if Sean doesn't know how to paint anything, then all these years of him watching me are... No, no. I just still got to look at the camera so I can answer people's questions sometimes. It's taking everything I have to not grab the brush, too. I understand. Oh, my gosh. Like, my my soul wants to how did i know this is not a bleeder okay the age of the piece it's a fairly modern piece um when when he moves i'll show you look at the color of the wood that's underneath it's a dark wood stain but that's a blonde wood it's a veneer so it's a thin layer of a light colored wood very unlikely likely to bleed plus it's got a finish on it already that's going to protect it uh, from getting through to my paint. So this is one I feel okay about leaving. Uh, uh, prep, Instagram is asking about prep. Our prep was clean it, scuff sand it, and we're putting paint on it. Cleaned with white lightning and a good scuff sanding. <laughs> well, I realized that if I let it keep going, I get cooled down from it too. Nicole says you're an aggressive painter. <laughs> got some anger issues he's getting out right now Nicole. I don't know if this is really the forum for that since Brandy's still here. Yeah. I got I got paint on my hands. I wasn't supposed to do that tonight. That's just horrible. Someone says you're missing a spot. It's giving them OCD. Here? The big spot in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> is it here? Jor here? Jordan thinks we're going to love this so much we're going to keep it in our house. Oh man. <laughs> I don't, I don't know about that. All right, so you're getting a solid base coat down. I like that. And then you can work in the other colors after you get some paint laid on there. you got to yes. have some paint laid on to be able to work in other colors. A new brand ambassador. Um, I don't know that we have any openings on the team. Yeah. I mean, My I'll, resume really I'll is... talk to the team lead. Oh, she said no. <laughs> That instant feedback. Yeah. <laughs> Sandy wants you to blend some paint. Oh, it is good coverage, huh? Yeah, look at that. That is good coverage. That's pretty solid coverage that you get in one coat of the paint. How much paint has he used from the jar? I don't know. What's that? Three quarters empty? <laughs> Come on now. Yeah, um, no, it's not bad. It's not bad. bad. It's not bad. It's, uh, he's going to clean his own brushes tonight. I wonder who the team lead is. I don't know, Brittany, but she rhymes with mushed by Brandy. <laughs> <laughs> so, I don't know. Eh. All right, whatever. <laughs> All right, what's we'll next? Just, we'll just bring it. Did you shake these? I thought, um, I don't, I'm not making any promises. I took the lids off. This is um, Savannah Miss Strahaney. Kimber is enjoying this. I'm no, glad I, you are, Kimber. <laughs> that makes me I will fun. later. Yeah. <laughs> it's painful for me to watch. Smooshed by Sean. <laughs> Dana, Dana. Destroyed by Wait, Sean. Wait, you guys, go search Sprayed by Sean. There is a Facebook page for it. It has no posts, but I told him he better take the page before someone else does. Uh, okay, you guys want to see his brush marks? All right, I'm yeah. gonna, I'll go in close. Get on Let's see. This is quality control right here. Oh man. Um, it's pretty. It's pretty good. I I would say like I'm not happy with this corner. That would probably not pass quality control. No drips. Good. Good. Root. Let's see. Um, in this crevice right here, uh, these crevices drive me nuts because see, it's not. Yeah. 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 yeah, 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 I'll, yeah, I'll, yeah I tell yeah, you yeah. why. Yeah. Let's. <laughs> Let's not kid here. All right, Instagram, I got this camera. All so right. that this corner right here is where I was talking. It's a little, I mean, we could clean that up. And then this crack right here, it's kind of uneven in the crack. That's the worst I can say though. I, it's smooth. Now I gotta be honest, because that's what I do. This is- You're pretty pleased with yourself? The, no, this is the first time I have ever laid paint on a piece of furniture without spraying it. <laughs> Spraying, not with a spray Not can, one of yeah. these, yeah. 
with this, not this, right? Sheila, those, I call them creme catchers. Those are just creme catchers. Why do they make them on furniture? Those divots, especially oh, when they're on the top. No, like these right here, these. Uh, oh, this? You're, you're supposed to be painting. I don't even see a I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Like this right here, these seams. You can use caulking and fill them in. Uh, Dixie Mud also works. You can fill them with your Dixie Mud and sand them smooth and get rid of all those crumb catchers. I gotta say, I'm a little nervous going into Can I just turn this piece of gold? No, no. I'm making you put a second co color on where you already painted. Come on now. You're so happy. I mean, I don't know. It's solid advice to say if you're just starting out, a solid color finish is a great place to start. It's easy to get comfortable, get a feel for the products, and then start working up too. But we're making you jump right in. This is... All right, can I... Never mind. Uh, Emmy, is it true no sanding with the silk paint? Uh, scuff sanding underneath silk is uh, always recommended. And then I, it's personal preference, but I do like a tiny light sanding in between my coats of silk, but that can be personal preference. It's not required, but the scuff sanding is recommended as part of your prep. Okay, so I want everybody to pay attention and get ready for the last, because what I'm going to do is... <laughs> Blend, blend out from here. Okay? You guys, he's shuddering. He's shuddering. I am he's so beyond nervous. visibly shaking yes. right now. This was not... Well, um, yeah. Don't you have to let it dry before a second coat? I mean, I mean, it really... It's, it's recommended. This is for you. Okay. We have 45 this, minutes here yeah. to do a lot. Okay, are we ready? Go. Okay. And oh. go. Beautiful circles. <laughs> okay, happy clouds. Happy clouds, I like it. Um, yeah, you like that? <laughs> Where's the best sting brush? Yeah, we're Let's going get that in. out. We're going in for Let's it. Let's get that out. Yes, that's what I'm going Jackie for. Jackie says mist with your water. Yes, what, yes, sec, yes. Our second color is sawmill gravy. So right now we're at um, Savannah mist and sawmill gravy. Okay. All right. Did you wear deodorant today? I really oh. <laughs> I'm feeling your stress. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Look at that. I, I like it. The swirling, that's working. Oh, it's cool. Okay, so he's using the oval medium. That's okay. Do you seal silk paint? Silk has a built-in top coat, Chara, so it, you don't have to seal it, but it is friendly with the top coats. If you wanted to use one, it's absolutely right, optimal. This is going to require a branding <laughs> Yeah, okay, it's looking good, though. You, you got your paint on the piece. That's the start. That's where you start. See, it's go, around, go around your edges a little more, a little more than in the center. Yeah, just focus on around the edges, soften that line. I swear I'm watching. Uh, Jackie says to wipe the excess paint off from your brush. It starts getting muddy and then it'll be harder. Uh, oh, yeah, your apron. That's one way to do it. Oh, it hasn't I mean, been done before. I mean, my apron. Yeah. That's a, okay. You guys, though, he's starting to pick up the Savannah mist from around the edges and it's working in. Do you see it softening? So it is, it is softening around the edges. You're going to start pulling your paint if you get too much water in the middle because you only have one coat and it's really fresh. So I would focus yes. around the edges. Smooth those edges out. <laughs> Gail, you're so glad you signed off. Are you sure about that? <laughs> oh, signed on. I, I was going to say, if you wanted to sign off, I would understand. She would have to put that on there if she was still on. <laughs> It's not bad. I think up around the top here, like this I'm struggling with. Yeah, feather that out a little bit. Yeah. That's pretty good, guys. I don't like your attitude. No, Ashley says she's impressed with your blending. I'm actually sleeping at the wheel. Should you sand silk, do a second coat? Because this is just your first, so you're just putting the color on. This is not idea. silk, you guys. So this, this is not silk. silk. I'm sorry if there was any misconception. This is silk paint. The color is Savannah Mist and Sawmill Gravy, but this is the chalk mineral paint. <laughs> if Sean can blend, anyone can blend. Yes, Gary. Sean blended. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> yes. Gary's on? No, Carrie. Oh, Carrie. Thank but you. I, I did see Gary earlier, I think. Oh, man. Um, I need to be able to sleep at night. You guys, he did. He blended. Okay, so I'm going to show you. This is just your first coat, though. I would say up here, yeah. it could be, it could use some finesse, but I, I actually think the bottom is, and the sides are pretty good. I think that's, I think it's pretty good for well, a first try, you guys. they back up like 10 feet. 
Sean has skills. Watch out, Brandy. Oh, our, <laughs> our income just got cut in half. Did I lose my job? <laughs> yeah. Where's Sheila? She was on. Um, yeah, I agree, Leona. It, it's kind of inspiring that you can just kind of open the box and paint with it. So are you going to add another okay. color to this side, or are you feeling I like you okay want to move on? Now. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to move on. Yeah, like get out while you're on a high, like yeah, Seinfeld. Yeah. I don't even know if it's on the high. I'm like getting out on the low. Like I just got kicked. <laughs> I was on my way out the door and somebody tripped me. That kind of thing. <laughs> All right, can I do the front? I mean, I'm not asking for my own. Instagram says this gives you hope. Uh, Thank what's, you. What's the difference between silk and chalk mineral paint? So silk is the all-in-one line from Dixie Belle, and it um, has a built-in top coat and a built-in stain blocker, but it is not as friendly to water, so it is not going to be your blendable paint like the chalk mineral line is. So here's Not my bad. basic rule of thumb for deciding whether you want silk or chalk mineral line. Silk is your very clean, smooth, refined finishes, um, more solid color finishes, and your chalk mineral line is gonna be your more artistic, decorative, blended finishes. I hope that helps. Apologies, just kind of moving that out of the way. All right, so we're gonna go on to the front, you guys. This is gonna be a little harder because those drawer fronts are gonna- happen quick. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we're going on to the... I'm going to go top to bottom, okay? That's how we're going to roll. Yeah, my voice was cracking. <laughs> like a teenage boy. Yeah. No different. We're going back in with some Savannah Mists on the front. He could rock a solid color finish, though. And he's trying to go quickly, so I sympathize with that. He turned that so slowly. It's like he's trying to draw it out, Debbie, huh? Come on now. <laughs> It's like he doesn't want to be here. <laughs> what colors? This is Savannah, Savannah Mist and Mist. Sawmill Gravy. These are two colors from the Brand Ambassador Inspiration Kit made by Bianca from Lotus Theory Designs. These are available um, on the Dixie Bell website. <laughs> it's like a circus in here. I will say it, it is a little tough to do this you guys definitely have talent that's a really good point i think it goes unnoticed but how it is a learned skill to try to connect talking while you're painting while you're actually performing yeah that is a learned skill absolutely i remember my first lives i had it it was very nerve-wracking it takes a while to learn to connect the two make your brain work while your hands are working <laughs> oh, he paints fast. I think he's feeling the pressure right oh, now, I, Sherry. I see how you, how you do it. They're rooting for you, though. They want it to be good. They so want it, as do I. <laughs> see, this keeps all my comments down. Sean has to be a good boy. When I, don't know, I, I feel like this is a solid base coat. But the second coat will really fix it. <laughs> They're really tying it together. Thanks for that. I don't know, maybe our income didn't get cut in half. Maybe our income just doubled. Well, this isn't spring, so. <laughs> oh, Marianne, the lives in the old garage. Yes, we we came a long way from there. It's, oh, from the, yeah. Marianne, uh, it just popped up on my memories. It's been five years since my first live. How crazy is that? You should have him do your makeup. <laughs> Can't read it. That's what just, am I doing now? That's just mean. And then you'll make me go out to Target with it like that. Oh, your makeup. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'll send you out to go do something. Is that Bob Ross? Uh, it looks like Bob Ross, but it's actually my husband, Sean. Oh, you mean the guy on the top. <laughs> Bianca's watching. Oh, come Bianca's on. Bianca's watching you. you come on. Bianca, Sean's painting with your kit. Oh, does come this, on. Does this make you proud, Bianca? <laughs> or, do, or does it make it you really want is. to pull your kit from the shelves? It really is. <laughs> I already sprayed this, by the way. Uh, how long have I been painting? I did my first piece in 2016. Bob, Sean, are you sweating 20 under? 20 minutes. Sean's not just sweating under the cap, he's sweating through the cap. Yeah. <laughs> Bianca says she'll let us know if this makes her proud. No, no reason. You don't have to respond. It's okay. Let's see, Bianca, you have five colors in your kit. He's using a solid two, and we're considering <laughs> that we're considering Rocket. that a win. <laughs> Rocket. <it. laughs> Kieran's laughing, not at you, with you. Of course, but I'm not laughing. 
You guys, I I do feel like he's got the single, and that's this is an accomplishment in itself. Like, don't don't even. Oh, you can discredit uh, I, all you want. Don't even underestimate. Like, there is beauty in a solid color finish. Am I selling it? Am oh, I then selling I'm it? done. <laughs> I, I just drop it. I'm going. Mic drop. Uh, uh, let's see. Spraying water before the product. Yes, he's using a little bit of water on the piece, and it just helps kind of lubricate your surface, helps your brush glide. Uh, we have a nice view of your back. I was just going to say, the back of my noggin. <laughs> yeah. Shall um, we talk about that haircut time? Uh, Dixie Belle is a water-based chalk mineral paint, so it's very friendly to water. Um, and if it feels a little thick going on, you can just use a little water and it helps it glide a little bit. Hello from Chile. Chile. Oh. All right, Savannah Mist is a really pretty color too. It really is. No need for, he's sweaty. He's spraying himself with the Mr. Bottle. It's just spraying himself. <laughs> it's no big deal, really. Okay, I'm done. You guys, the good news is, is that this is saving my Manny tonight. Look at that. What? No paint for the first time ever. No paint. Look at that. Clean as a whistle. <laughs> Which is the new brush cleaner from Dixie Bell, by the way. <laughs> See how he's slid that in? <laughs> is Brandy cleaning brushes tonight? Brittany, shut your mouth. Yes. All right. Are we getting our so second color on tonight? You have time. I don't want you to feel like you don't have what? time. No, you, yeah, we'll make huh? it work. <laughs> what? You go with your blending self. If you need another brush, I'm going to get you a clean brush. What? No. You're going to, you'll like having a clean brush. What? <laughs> you'll like it. This is the OCD you, you, brandy. You done, you oh, done ruined you, that one. You'll, you'll want to use another brush. So here. Oh uh, yeah, what do you guys think? Like a little highlight around the hardware? I do have to get new hardware for this because the pulls were missing. No, it's it's all yeah. there. Yeah, uh, Kimber, I'm stressing on the drawers a little bit. Does Sean what? does Sean need a manicure? Um, he... <laughs> so okay, story time. Oh come on, <laughs> killing me. Sean, his thing isn't so much hands. He is a foot person. He come on now. Is Super. This is really bothering Super. Um, I'm ditching that. I'm going here. <laughs> Hi. Uh, he really pays attention if his feet are smooth and like nails are clipped and I mean, this is like, really yeah, the feet are done. And if other people don't have good feet, he will send me pictures on his cell phone from yes. his office and say, "Today was an open toe chew day. I just can't." Oh come on. <laughs> That is true. You can't. Yeah, he sends me pictures. That's <laughs> so wrong. Okay, so we're going with the second color. So, Sawmill gravy is our second color. It's probably a little heavy. I should yeah. I should whisper so he can't hear us. Sean has a That's foot fetish. Marilyn, so he does. Stuff. But I have good feet, so we're okay. It's probably the best part of my best thing I have going on. <laughs> yeah. A little bit of crazy, but good feet. Oh, I done botched this. I would say it's a little heavy on the sawmill yeah. gravy. He's going to have to really work that paint in. You could add a little bit of Savannah mist to kind of counteract that. Um, you counteract it? Yeah. Get go, the camera lady on. Get your, back, get your brush with the Savannah mist and work it with that brush instead. Because you kind of need to balance it back out again. What do you do with the brush in between coats? So... Um, I would recommend either, you can either rinse it out, it depends on how long it's going to be between your coats, or you can stick it in a Ziploc bag and put it in your refrigerator if, it's, if you're coming back to it not this, too long after. I done botched this one. See, look at that you guys, though, the, see the little bit of Savannah mist and you bring that back in, and now if you come swirl those together, it's going to, you'll have paint that's equivalent from both colors. E roughly equal parts of A and B. I mean, B. what you're going for is, yeah. Yeah, there you go, off to the side. We, we want to see this. Oh, yeah. Sorry, <laughs> Georgia, I can't guarantee you, but if I do paint over it, I'll do it late at night so he doesn't know. That could really, like it could really destroy, it could destroy an ego. That's a pretty good blend, though. He no, just needed a little bit. No, not destroy an ego. He just needed a little bit more of the uh, Savannah Mist. Sheila, we'll stick with sprayed by Sean. I feel like that's, that's, <laughs> you know, <laughs> come on. You know, no when to hold them. Oh, I'm folding. Yeah, it's it's a that's a solid cloud in the middle. It's like a it's a soft cloud. Yeah, that's 
That's embarrassing. <laughs> it's okay. I don't mind it. I don't hate it. Are you gonna? You're I'm not gonna, gonna change gonna it, but I don't that, hate right? it. I'm not gonna fix that. It would really hurt my feelings. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I've been hurting your feelings for 20 years now. Oh, so this is very true. She's going to paint this as soon as it's dried. I don't even know if I can wave her to dry. It's really here. Come here. It's you really. Paint. It's painful come to here. me right now. No, we're not done yet. You have oh. another drawer to do. Oh, oh, we're done. No. Yeah, yeah. He does better than you in blending. No, he doesn't, Elizabeth. <laughs> I've seen your work. Your work is beautiful. Oh. You just posted said that. You just posted Somebody that just kind, of, kind of Egyptian piece, which was really cool. What brushes uh, do you usually use for blending? I My favorite brushes, I love the Dixie Bell Mini for laying my paint on and the Oval Medium for blending it out. But, wait, wait, wait. Can I have you try something? Oh. Go ahead, go ahead and put, sure. Go ahead and put your paint on. Huh? Uh, I'm going to have him try, you guys, the best thing brush because it comes in um, Bianca's oh, kit. This clue. And I'm going to see if that helps him at all. I this is called, this is where I want it to be. <laughs> this right is here. brand new. I would recommend anytime you have a new brush like this, wash it out first, but we're going to go with it. Wash it out and work your bristles out. I want it to be more of this happy color. Yeah, that one's better. You yeah. went lighter on the Savannah Mist this Don't time. Don't talk to me like that. So my answer to that for blending, I like the oval medium for blending my paint out this or this best name brush too. I mean, I'm already messing it up. Again, sorry, Bianca. Oh. Bigger is always better. Less is more. Keep going. Build those <laughs> forearm muscles. <laughs> we, need so, a, we need a paint technique that builds abs. We need a paint technique <laughs> that doesn't kill my back. Yeah, Sean does have a bad back, you guys. He's bending over on this. I mean, plus, I make him pick up furniture all the time. He wishes I would have taken up knitting. Yeah. Um, blending right. brush needs to be a natural brush. No, I actually like here. Try, you want to, ooh, that was a good save, huh? So no, the good part would have been not letting it happen yeah, to begin that, with. That's true. It's not in the rescue. It does not have to be a natural bristle brush. I actually really like no, oh. <laughs> no. Get your own. Are you handing this I'm to showing, me? I'll show it, and then you can have it. Swirl that out with that brush, though. I actually like Try? the, oh, yeah. OCD brandy? Yeah. <laughs> Just around the edges. Get those edges really good. Oh, Use funny, a little then. little bit of water. Yeah. That's what I was going for. Okay, I'm sorry. I was coaching you from the sidelines. I'm rooting for you. Okay, that's helping. He's pulling a little bit of paint. This is really fresh paint, you guys. I would say you definitely want to let your paint yeah. dry. I'm not but gonna do that. yeah, you are. Keep going. Oh, okay. Just... It's entertaining for us. <laughs> Um, I actually like a synthetic brush. This will give you a smoother type blend, whereas the um, besting brush kind of gives you a textured, cloudy effect in your blending. So different looks, but really pretty. That's okay. You don't have to get full coverage because this is just your base coat. Oh, do you see that? That was the money shot right there. Whoa. Yeah, what he just did right there, swirling those colors together. He is a loud painter. He never stops talking. This is very yes. true, whether you're painting or not. Oh, this is making yeah. my heart happy. All right, you guys. Oh, I'm done then. This. <laughs> this, this, this is it. I feel like this is saying like the the besting brush is a beginner's blending brush, yes. and I agree with that. All the room I need right here. Yeah, yes. <laughs> surface area. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Can you dig it? It's nice and soft. It's kind of cloud. It looks like a cloud. It does with the a sawmill gravy and savanna mist kind of swirl together. Nice soft edges. Except for that. Uh, you could go back. Up. That's okay because this is just your first coat. So yeah. if you have a little bit of pulling, it has to get a second coat anyways. I'll pull this. I usually lay my base coat on and I don't really work it because it's your base. And then you could really work your second coat and be a little more aggressive on your paint. You give it 24 hours between coats and that first coat's gonna set up and then you can work over the top of it. So what do you guys think? That Is top everybody door- everybody really messing with me tonight? Meh, meh. How much are you paying him to do this? <laughs> I do pay my kids to prep for me sometimes. <laughs> Zero. But we have a joint bank account, so it's all good. Yeah. <laughs> all right, you guys. Okay, guys. <laughs> what do you guys think? I'm show, out. Show Sean some love. He was no, a, no. He was a really good sport for even doing this. Did take some convincing. 
the bottom he didn't blend out the bottom down here but that's okay i think this could be left and just do the drawers and that would still be pretty and we have three other colors to incorporate yeah we, didn't, we didn't quite get there <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So, so two color blend is a really pretty look, and it's it's an accomplishment. This was a first coat. We gotta stop showing so much. You're food. getting tons of hearts. Yeah, yeah they yeah. liked it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, you wanna you wanna sign us out? <laughs> or is that my call? I'm that's you. Is that my cue to come back on? Yeah, camera? yeah, that's All you. Right. <laughs> I'm gonna be rude and just walk in front of the camera. Um, I felt better sitting further away from the piece. Oh man. Is there um? There's still room back there? Yeah, there's... This is... This is That's a... it. I don't get to right. see too many train wrecks, okay, but I'm that... Show, I'm going to show this part. I'm going to show this part. He ended up using two colors, mind you. Seven... Yeah. Out of how many? 74 brushes. <laughs> two colors in this many brushes. So... Well, it's because you're going to clean them. <laughs> yeah. Hold on. I got some more brushes to use. Um, that's a little extreme. But if all else fails, get out a new brush, right? All right, you guys, that was pretty fun. <laughs> I enjoyed it. For those who say they're impressed, it, yeah, uh, sorry. It's it, it could be worse. It could be worse. It could. It, I, I could have done it. nothing. Yeah, I don't hate it. I feel like we're in a solid direction. Where would I go from here? I'm going to smooth out the blend just a little bit. Just, just a little bit. Wait a minute, Gary's on. <laughs> just a little bit. Gary, Gary's a painter. Gary knows. Gary can Oh, I know. It. I would add some of our darker colors kind of around here to frame it out. Our darker colors that come in this kit. I've got Stormy Seas and Pinecone, and I think a I would probably use a little bit of both of those. Maybe my Pinecone just on the corners and Stormy Seas around here and frame these out a little bit. Um, I'd probably use a little bit of them too. You know, I feel like now you're just pointing out my, yeah. my errors. <laughs> but... I think if he were to go and do a second coat on this, this could be a finished looking piece. And then with the transfer over the top, you'll never notice what the paint looks like. How right? big is the transfer? <laughs> is it like a blanket? Like, maybe like a, <laughs> yeah, it's like a moving blanket. You just I'm going to give it, it a distressed look by putting it on the back of the truck <laughs> and then going really fast. If all else fails, distress. All right, you guys, this was fun. Thank you for hanging out with us. We used uh, the Brand Ambassador Inspiration Kit tonight. This one is the box from Bianca with Lotus Theory Designs, which is really pretty. It includes the lace transfer from Dixie Bell. So this is the transfer that would go over top. It's kind of a gray, really pretty filigree design. So you can see how it will coordinate with these colors. Ladies, uh, thank you. They're the, all lies, but thank you. On the body, you. we have uh, Savannah Mist and Sawmill Gravy. Those are both two colors that are in the kit. There's three more colors as well that we didn't get to tonight. Um, and then the Best Stain Brush is also in there. I will link these uh, to the link that I put in this post. I will link them directly to the inspiration kits when I get off. Um, but these are available on the Dixieville website. Um, I always appreciate if you purchase through that link. That keeps us up and running. <laughs> um, I, I, not, earn for this. <laughs> I earn a small percentage from there, but you can also use that link to, um, to find a local retailer in your area and they um, have access to the inspiration kits as well. Um, are you you want to mention the kit once more? The kit? The kit. Okay, so this, is, uh, this comes in the kit, which is the card, and this one's by um, Bianca from Lotus Theory Designs. There's 12 kits and each one is different. Each brand ambassador of the 12 of us uh, curated a different kit. And then there's a link to a tutorial on the back. So if you really wanted to see how Bianca used all this together, you can watch her tutorial as well. Um, so let's see, I have a video coming out on my YouTube channel tomorrow, you guys, at Brushed by Brandy. So check that out. It has some layering. We create kind of a weathered wood effect. Um, and that'll be on my YouTube channel tomorrow. If you guys haven't already, heard uh, me and Leah from Leo Noel Design Co. are teaching at the Pinners Conference in Indianapolis, Indiana. A month, in a month, you guys, October 8th and 9th um, in Indianapolis. We will be there. My travel is booked. I am coming. We are teaching five classes over two days. It's going to be intense. You get to take all your projects home, a lot of really cool techniques, and you really get to put your hands on a lot of the products that you see us using. Uh, so check out the Pinners Conference. I will also link that in the post. Donna says that I'm going to have fun reading the comments later. Yeah, <laughs> they're not bad. You guys are really good to Sean tonight. Thank you guys for being good. Thank you, everyone. And having fun with us. I will catch you guys next week, uh, 9 p.m. Eastern. Have a good weekend.